Yes, what's good everybody? So, super quick shit vid. Not been too much to speak about the past couple of days. Um, how's everybody going? I've officially unfollowed Ben White. So, I took a lot of people's advice saying he got to unfollow him. So, I have done just that. Uh, we've got Ajax on Wednesday. Should be a good game. Obviously, we're getting dangerously close to Scum away next next week, next Saturday, innit? So, um, a couple of weeks' time. I think tickets go on sale for on like Wednesday or something I read earlier or something like that. that they go on sale pretty soon. There's no update on Lorente or Pascal at minute uh, with their injuries. But, I mean, Lorente didn't seem to be in too much discomfort, did he, when he was leaving the pitch? But it's obviously not good. But they're obviously, with former sick note, they're obviously not risking him you know, with anything, especially pre-season, like, um, bullshit talk, but Gabriel, um, he's complimented Rafinha, he's an Arsenal centre-back, uh, he complimented Rafinha on his Instagram, just saying that he's a big fan of his and that, which doesn't mean anything, but it's just a bit of shit talk. Tottenham are apparently in for Traore as well now, not that, we, not that we've made a bid or anything, but Adama Traore apparently Tottenham, because obviously they've got the Nuno link, can't they, obviously, was it Wolves and what have you, so, Apparently they want him. They're looking at like forty-five million or something, which is quite a lot. The West West Brom's manager, who I don't know his name, he's said that Pereira um, is not committed to the cause. So they've they've had like the first for the pre-season games and stuff, and he just says he doesn't look committed to to being at West Brom. So that might be interesting. I think he might be on the move. I want to mention Adam Forshaw as well, because obviously, if he was to be fit, is that like a new signing? Is that you know, is it a good shout? We need we need that midfielder in there as well, like certainly back up, which we, everybody keeps mentioning. Uh, and is Adam Forshaw fit? Is he good enough? Um, I would say probably was. I think Bielsa speaks quite highly of him, although I don't think he, he's perhaps a bit frustrated with him overall, um, just because obviously he's been extremely injured. Past two years he's been injured. Um, but yeah, that'd be interesting. But I've not really seen much of him since when he played the other day last week or whatever it was. And then that Angel Herrera, he's he's doing rounds again. So Man City are looking to sell him. Venezuelan midfielder, 23-year-old. Uh, West Ham have been in for him. He's been out on loan a couple of times and stuff. But it's just interesting because obviously Man City are buying, well, looking like they're buying Harry Kane and Jack Grealish. So would they be looking... I mean, Man City aren't too bothered about offloading players, I suppose, but it would be. You know, he's definitely not going to get anywhere near... I mean, he's, to be fair, he doesn't play that position. He plays that sort of more defensive role in midfield, but, you know, they're, they're going to have to offload some players, really, like you would imagine. I'm just talking shit. I don't know about that, really. But, yeah, what you're saying, if you follow me on Instagram, drop us a message and I'll follow you back. And, uh, yeah, stay social. Keep it, keep it mint. Uh, no new members to shout out today. So, 99p a month goes a long way. Yes, take it easy, everybody. I will be in and around. I'm working tomorrow, so, but I'll be in. I'll be back soon. Nice, and I might be back tomorrow night, tomorrow afternoon. In a bit. Surprises why I asked.